guys what is up it's me super cute kitty and i'm back with another video today i'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to do a text reveal effect in case if you're wondering i am using the app called video star you see that cool text reveal effect that i did that revealing of the text yeah i'm going to be showing you guys how to do that today so let's get started so the first thing that we're going to go to is new and then we're going to hit multi-layer after that we're going to go to the first layer and your first layer is going to be your original clip. Then your second layer, which is right there in case if you're wondering, your second layer is going to be a text. When you hit text, put the lyrics that you want to reveal, and this is basically the lyric. And if you want to make it look nice and aesthetic, you can go ahead and put this dash and then a space. I'll hit done. And then you could put it anywhere you want. You could place it anywhere you want. I recommend it to put it here because that's where I'm going to be showing you guys how to do it. But you could put it on the top, the sides. You could put it twisted, tilted. Now we're going to go to the third layer. And on the third layer, this is going to be different. We're going to go to color. We're going to try to aim for a green color. Why? Because we're going to do a green screen. Try to go for something near this. Don't go for like a green like this because it's not going to work. Neither go for a green like that or like this. Go for green right there and then go to add mask. You're going to add a mask on the third layer, not the second or the first, the third layer. Then we're going to go to shape and we're going to minimize it to the size. And it's basically covering up our words. Now we're going to go to the third layer and we're gonna edit its keyframes. Go to the top right corner and go to options. When you click options, go to show other layers. So show other layers. And you're going to pick the both layers, show layer 1 and layer 2. After we do that, we're going to have to follow the lyrics and listen to it so we can reveal. So let's listen to what the first lyric says. She. So this is a, by the time that he says she, it's already over here, right? So we're going to mark where he says she, and we're going to make that a path. There we go. And what this means is that by the time that I hit this, the green screen is going to move all the way to the side and expose the she lyric. So look at it. See that? If you want to go ahead and make it faster, you can make it faster. Don't finish this right here, so I'm going to go one more back. Path it, and then leave for don't. So see it. Then you reveal the want. And you see how the love is typed slow? I'm going to go at the pace of it. Everybody has different lyrics at different paces, so you don't have to follow my exact pace, but this is the way that I'm doing it. So let's see where love ends. Love basically ends at the end, so therefore I'm going to make that a path and end it all the way. So let's see how it looks now. See how slow it goes for love? Yeah. Now we're going to hit back. And once you are done with your green screen and moving it, you're going to hit create. Now that we created this, you also have to listen to this step because I usually confuse it as well. We're going to go to new again. Go to multi-layer. And we're going to use the first layer. Listen to this. The first layer is going to be your original clip. Your second layer is going to be your green screen clip. In order to erase the green screen, we have to add a mask to the second layer. So we're going to go to color now, not shape, color. And we're going to delete the green. If the green is showing, so you see how sometimes they have a green line here? Play around with it until you see that it's entirely like gone. And you can go back and forth to check. See, there's no more left. Another tip to you is to always keep it on off. Even if you're trying to look for how to erase the green, keep it on off. Because look, it would affect your whole clip. So keep it on off. Then hit done when you're finished. And I look at the results. You might see a little weird effect there. Don't worry. You're not going to see it at all because the edit goes by so fast. So now let's look at the final product. See how easy that was? Thank you for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. I hope this tutorial really helped you out. But if you want to go ahead and slow down the video or pause, go ahead, take your time. Also, if you would like me to do any other tutorials on how to edit, just comment down and request some things that you would like to learn. It could either be effects, transitions, overlays, backdrops, how to do moving backgrounds, backgrounds, all that stuff. I got you guys. Just go ahead and request it. Peace. Hashtag super team.